February 1962, 4.30 in the afternoon, Colonel Sabalik calls me to his office and says, Vern, get all the Germans out of here. This is 4.30. Get the police, the civilian workers, get them out of the MP station. You don't tell a German to leave an hour early. That, that's not the way they work. They're, they're, not, they're, they're not computed that way. Uh, he called me in his office again and nibbled some more, and soon they were gone. At 5 o'clock, three men in civilian clothes show up, and we put one of them in, in the detention cell downstairs, and the other two guarded the detention cell, and no one was allowed down there. The next morning, Colonel Sabalik says, Vern, get me to Alpha 10, the Brücke der Einheit, the Freedom Bridge that separated Potsdam from West Berlin. So we drive out there. He's behind me. We get out there, and he said, Vern, put those German guards in the shack on the floor so they can't look out. Now, he didn't tell me I couldn't look out, but anyway, I go in there, down they go, and I look out the window, and these three gentlemen get out of the car that the colonel was in, and they walk out to the middle of the bridge, and three come from the other side and come out, and they exchange the two in the middle. Back in the car, Colonel Sabalik says, Tempelhof, ASAP, as soon as possible. Blue light, off we go. Forty minutes later, we arrive at Tempelhof, the airplane, a four-engine, DC-6B, propellers turning, Three men go up the walkway, get on the airplane, it takes off. Colonel Spock says, you know who that was? I said, no, sir, it's Gary Powers.